Hey guys, welcome back. We are going to um, Wings Airport, just a little north of Philadelphia. I have Olive with me right here. She has her little um, headset on here, so she could. I know. <coughs> Excuse me. Can't probably hear me. So we're we'll gonna have her along today, and uh, we'll see how she does. She's been here doing this a couple times already, and we're at Orange County. Going to Wings, and she'll chill back there. And uh, I don't think anybody is behind us with the fuel pumps. Put eight one zero. Sky condition clear. Temperature zero seven Celsius. Dew point minus zero one Celsius. Altimeter three zero five two. Remarks: Density altitude minus one thousand one hundred. Orange County Airport, Montgomery, New York. Automated weather observation, 1524 Zulu. Wind calm. Visibility, 10. Okay, winds are calm. We'll go use 26. Um, I don't think anybody's using uh, 4. 4 typically we can use 4 going north, we're going south. Um, so we'll use 26. We have a helicopter coming in. We'll go to the wings. Here in the run up area, we'll put it to GPS. Um, so we're doing good today. Nice, beautiful, beautiful day for sure. Um, so winds are calm today for the most part. We get a little bit later, be five miles per five knots. Um, but it's not bad. It's easy. I'm gonna do a run up here. Cannon, right back with you guys. Okay, so we're gonna go to the wings, put that in the GPS now. A little direct, let's see. It's not, it should be out of all the fun airspace for the most part. It's going to the fourth flight here. Uh, but just forget the identifier. Oh, L-O-M. Go direct to K, Emma, Oscar, Mike. And we're activated. Orange County traffic, Diamond 1, Lima Alpha, departing runway 4, Orange County. So we'll be out of New York's airspace, we'll be Orange out of County, we'll be in Philly's airspace. Uh, we got to get down uh, to 3,500. We're going to go up to 65 in a way, so we'll bug 65. We have 65 in air. It looks good here. I'm going to get flight following. Uh, 3275 is already in the standby. We don't need that. And let's get out of here. So we're going to do... Um, I did set... Everybody knows now. Uh, I did set the... Um, miles per hour to knots. So everything now is a knot. So now i got to get used to knots. I've been using miles per hour for a long time. Uh, but doing IFR stuff, everything's knots. So and i got to get used to doing knots, which is not a big deal. We're going to rotate at 60 knots now, not 70 miles per hour. And the VY is 87 knots, 100 miles per hour. And gear up, flaps up, then we'll climb out at 100 knots, which I have bugged over here, actually. Just a little reminder. And um, we're good to go. 26 okay, manifold pressure, 26 RPMs, mixture is as required. And the fuel pump comes off and blah, 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 blah. And then cruise will, the throttle will be set and... Get that all fun stuff out of the way. Um, so we're ready to go. We're flap 15. Um, fuel pump will come on very shortly. Lane light is on. Strobes are on. Orange County traffic. Diamond. Doors are locked. Alpha is upwind. Runway and 4 remaining in the pattern. Orange County. There she is. Okay. Now they're using 4. Now there's another traffic. But the windsock is actually favoring 2.6 very, very slightly.
In order channel traffic, anybody uh, short base of final for four? In order County traffic, uh, Mooney 8 September is taking uh, 2 6 for a straight out departure. Orange County. Okay. Full pump now is coming on. We're good. Orange County traffic, Warrior 5 Zulu Ski Romeo is entering the left down runway 04 on the 45, Orange County. Orange County traffic, Diamond 1, Lima Alpha is crosswind, runway 4, behind the traffic on downwind, Orange County. It's Orange County traffic, we need parting 2-6, we'll be everybody's way here in a short, in a minute. All right. Rotate. Gears coming up. Gears locked. Good orange kind of traffic. Uh, moving to partner pattern to the southwest. See you later. All right, flaps coming up. Traffic Comanche's going to take uh, runway 08. Hey, flaps up, gears uh, up. Are you departing? I'm sorry, I just saw you. No, we're just hanging out here. Okie dokie. Uh, Orange County traffic Comanche's departing runway 08, straight out to the east. Orange County Warrior 50 is turning base runway 4, Orange County. Hey, flaps are up, gear is up. Orange County traffic, Diamond 1, Lima Alpha is midfield downwind runway 4, looking for departing traffic on 8. Get over to New York now. See how busy they are today. One four Zulu contact the New York approach one two four point zero seven. Good day. One one four Zulu. Can you repeat that again, please? One two four point what? One two four point zero seven twenty four oh seven. One two four point zero seven. Thank you. Yeah, New York. Good morning, Mooney six eight eight seven November with request. Good morning, calling. Stand by. I'll be right with you. Right, she's already asleep back there. <laughs> we'll keep her climbing. We got some traffic underneath us. Thirteen hundred. Four ninety two. Contact near Center. Oh, pump can come off now. Lane light can come off. And we're just cruising along now. And the Mooney calling here. Go ahead. Just a part of Orange County, sir. Um, headed to Wings. Um, uh, King Larry Oscar Mike. Requesting flight following. Going to five six thousand five hundred. Did you say the call sign? Uh, Mooney 6887 November. 6887 November, squad 0330, ident. 0330. Alaska 160, contact New York Center 132.17, good day. 7 November, your radar contact about uh, 10 to the southwest of Stewart, 3100, Stewart Altimer, 3053. 3053, thank you, sir, for 8, 7 November. Okay. November, you do have ferry 1 o'clock and about uh, 5 miles eastbound out to the 3000 type unknown. Looking for traffic for 8, 7 November. Okay, so we're heading up. A traffic somewhere out there. We keep looking. I have him on our screen. He's just passing our our path right now. He's 300 feet below. 
And we're climbing 700 feet per minute. We're looking good. On Papa Sierra, what are your intentions? After we uh, cross uh, Kingston again, we'd like to request the uh, RNF 26. Okay, let me know when you're ready. We'll go on Papa Sierra. Over this track, it's in like circles. One hundred feet below us. Where? Got him here on the screen, in the sky view on the Ivodine. Um, so we have him, just can't see him yet. Don't know where he is. Sandwich at 11 o'clock in about a uh, mile northeast bound out to Traffic in sight, sir. We'll maintain visual for 8 7 November. Thank you. There he goes. Okay, everything's looking smooth. Here for 791 Papa Sierra, we can. Uh I'd like to request direct bunnery for the uh, procedure turn inbound RNF 26 at Orange County. You're not going to go straight in from bunnery? No, we'd like to do the uh, procedure turn inbound just for uh, practice. Okay, uh, direct to bunnery, report your procedure turn inbound. Maintain that at above 3,000 uh, in total uh, to proceed inbound. Roger, direct to bunnery, report procedure turn inbound, one puppet here. Papa Sierra, there's no separation service provided for this approach. Maintain VFR at all times and report you proceed turn inbound. VFR at all times and uh, we'll report inbound. One Papa Sierra. 87 November, contact New York approach on uh, 120.15. Good day. 2015 for 8 November. Good day. Thank you. Good day. I'm going to say 6 2. We'd like to uh, cancel flight following. I'm going uh, 6 2. Say again. Uh, Terminal State 6-2 would like to cancel flight following. Terminal State 6-2, roger, racers, turn right, squawk 1200, for whose change is approved. Have a good day. Squawk VFR, have a good day from the State 6-2. New York, good morning, Mooney. 688, Senator Member is with you. Uh, 5,200 for 6,500. 688, 7 November, New York, approach, altimeter 3055. 3055, 8, 7 November. Okay. 3055, New York, parts of it are contact, I maintain 6,000. I did the playback, so I don't recognize that channel, so I'll make sure I got that right. We're looking good, we're climbing through 5,400. We'll go direct elevate, I just need Okay, we have 200 feet almost remaining, which will call it out, approaching altitude. A crosswind of 11 knots coming from 271. Approaching altitude. Okay, approaching altitude, thank you for that.
Contact We're cruising along. That's good. Okay, so we're level, we're lean, we are trimmed. Um, we're on with New York, flight following, going to Wings. Wings. Okay. And. Let's get our AWOS in here. So we'll tune that to the comm here. That's already in there. Okay, we're 1361, turn left 220, direct Elvay. To, to Sierra, direct Elvay, 1361. I don't think they have weather out there, let's just see. Five, yeah, they do, good. Alright, so six minutes ago, it's VFR. Um, winds 050 at five. Car two, radar contact, five, maintain five. Knots. Maintain five, 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 And clear, we're good. I checked that last night, we're all good. The weather today. Some haze, which haze is okay, um, because it's the, the, it tends to be a little bit less bumpy with the haze. That means the wind is not really moving. It calls a lot of turbulent air. Uh, we'll probably use 06. 1720, turn left, heading 300, I'm going to take 6,000. We'll anticipate 06. And what was the frequency weight, 170 again? 170 mic, 124.45. 24.45. 24.45, so on. You probably won't see Philly because of the haze. Climb, maintain 10,000. 10, now we have a, 40, 40, let's go around here a little bit here. So we're at, for the Skyview HDX, we got 65, we buck 65, we're at 65. Um, we have Highway in the Skies alive. Um, we got the inches, outside temperature is 42 degrees. Um, we're on the IFD 540, we're 72.4 miles away, direct to wings. Lima, Oscar, and Mike. Um, my second comm is down here. We don't need to do it. Use it. Um, we have the course heading. We're crabbing a little bit. 26, uh, 226. The course is 222. So 226, 227. We have a crosswind component here of 08. Coming out of 250. That's a little bit of a crab. Um, 35 knots. 74% power. Um, Two out, airspeed 148, ground speed 132. But eight, not almost direct headwind, not quite, but close. The way home, we'll get a little bit of a push. We have down here um, the carburetor temperature. Dark American uh, is 54 29, degrees. Yeah, two for three thousand. Good, not freezing. And of course, the voltage is here. We're using an amp. Um, Battery is doing good. Nice, it's charging nicely. These are all my cylinder temperatures. Exhaust temperatures looking good with that. Our oil pressure is in the green. Oil temperature is in the green. Fuel pressure is in the green. We're burning about 11, 10, 5 to 11 gallons an hour. I'd like to run it a little ri a rich of peak. It's just it is what it is. It's my preference. I can lean it out to probably nine right now. Uh, we'll keep that. Got these. All right, let's do it. The perimeter and up to is that one zero. Primary display here. Light display, and we have that full map on this side, which is nice. I like to have that. So well, basically, like I said a long time ago, I don't really need this anymore. I use it. Uh, I'm going to use it a lot. I use it, use it a lot more in IFR, doing my flight planning. And I can send it to the panel, which is nice. Uh, but we're good. So here, we're at 60, the GPS out to the 63. We're going, the next away point is Wings. 62 nautical miles away, 30 minutes. 913 November Lima, New York, departure time, maintain 5,000 and I done. 
We're doing pretty good. Lima, your radar contact is 1,600. Very nice system. I love it a lot. Here's 224. 224 with that crosswind is a good heading, so I'm going right, to hit this button zero, here one, two, zero, and get that needle to 225. Three degrees off the course heading. That's that right crab. Yeah, 222, 224, right crab to uh, offset the um, um, crosswind component of now five. We have no. We're not going to hit any airspace. Actually, let's change this to the uh, uh, menu. Let's go to players. Let's go to sectionals. Check it out. Yeah, we're not going to hit any any airspace. Hey, right here's New York. I don't know if you guys can see it well. Right there's New York. TFR is in the area. We're here. Um, but we're all set with no TFRs all the way down. So here's Philadelphia Airport, Philadelphia, we're just north of Philly, northwest-ish. Oh, this is, this is my iPad. 913 November Lima, turn left heading 220. No weather out there, really. No, there's some weather out here. Approach at 741. Well, that's way far away from us, though. 741, New York, Roach, Roger, uh, Morristown, altimeter is 3054. That's our flight for today. Looking great. Everything's nice. Olive is doing okay back there. Has her earmuffs on. I said 641, you get to send a 2000, you're 5 from K White, K White at or above 2000, third on now 5 approach. 2000, K White uh, at or above 2000, third on now 5, exit at 741. What are we doing out there? Doing pretty good? I got a couple people I've been in contact with. They're getting their, their private. That's really cool. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Number 6887 November. Contact Pro 728.55 today. 2855.5 now for 8th November. Good day. New York, good morning. Looney 688. 7 November is with you, level 6500. Looney 688, 7 November, New York, New York, Council, over to 3054. 3054, 8, 7 November. I always say this ATC, those guys are, and gals are awesome. <laughs> you gotta think of their workload. Uh, for a second. Now it's not as busy. It's not as busy. It's not as busy with uh, commercial right now because they're still going through the COVID stuff. Um, but sixteen sixty three one three miles from Cali, flying. They have to really focus on commercial. You know, plus they have to focus on runway four right approach. You know, GA zero eight zero and three. I'm sorry, four thousand. Excuse me, the GA guys like us. So it, those guys are, are got a lot going on. God bless them. 1663, do make it 3,000 until established the funnel. Then, of course, we practice approaches. We got to get ATC involved. Then we do this, and we do that, light following. And then worrying about commercial. And it's just a lot going on sometimes for them. Rolls off the tongue, right? Holy mackerel. November 70 whiskey to set maintain 4,000. 4,000 times over here. Jet 824. Uh, flight heading 070. There's traffic 1 o'clock and 6 northeast bound 5,400 unverified. Heading 070. We're looking for that driver, J24. I'm going to switch tanks. I'm trying to look for. Oh, I can make that airport. 1663 no speed is. Got this white circle. About 7 inch The Dynon puts on the screen. You've got to put all your information in the system. Get your glide and all that fun stuff. And it puts that green circle around it. You can glide to. God forbid you lose an engine. So I can make, I can make an airport. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch tanks. You've been flying. Let's see, actually. Let's go to um, display. Let's go to engines. 
Run time is 30 minutes right now. Uh, air time, 20. Uh, we use four gallons, four and a half gallons already. It's not bad. Um, so we're going to switch, actually, you know what? Yeah, we're going to switch tanks. Because we are a little, uh, I use the left side first, and the right side has three more gallons more than the left, so we'll switch it. Let's go back to display, let's go full screen. Um, so yeah. Turn right Look at that. 080 and intercept the localizer for runway 6. IFD 540 I have um, in there set for 30 minutes. Switch tanks. Switch tanks. So I'm going to put the fuel pump on. Look at Olive back there, guys. Isn't she doing good? I got to get a picture. I know it's not, you know, you got to get the picture. We got to get the picture in there. He is just focused and having fun. You know, we're her little, <laughs> she's really, she's a really good dog, I gotta say. Uh, chocolate Lab. Okay. Buckle, because so I can't bend enough with, I can latch this, I can loosen it. So fuel pump's gonna come on. Okay, right, fuel pump is on, we're gonna switch tanks to the left. So go down. Switch tanks, we're good to get back on, a little bit off course, not much. Back on course. That is towards your right, near Capro, Jordan, okay. Yankee, runway 4, right, Clean with the seatbelt. Down to 3055. Got it, United 408. And. 70 Whiskey, turn left, heading 120. The fuel pump off. 203,000, 70 Whiskey. And we still have the fuel pressure. Fuel pressure. It comes down a little bit because it doesn't have the pump pushing out. We're good there too. 3,000, Virginia 24. Get back on the 225 heading. Okay, 52 nautical miles to go. 70 Whiskey, turn left, heading 100. So we can descend at any time. We'll let them know. I have. I won't be in anybody's airspace. I got to get down to. Before we get to Philly's airspace, I got to be down to. Here's that 30 mile outer ring. Now, I get a lot, you know, not I don't get questions really on it, but some people do ask about it, even through conversation. You need ADSB to get into that. So. Um, so these little, all these little, airp all these little airports in here, if you don't have the ADSB, uh, update, you can't get in there. Well, you can, you got to call, file, and then do it that way if you have an old transponder. You know, because sometimes you have the old transponder, and you want to get it changed out, you might be in that airspace to go to your avion sky. So there's ways around it, but do it every single time, it's just stupid. Uh, so you, yeah, that's that's where you have to be in there. So we have to get down the outer circle here. If you look here, let's go find it. Four zero eight, turn right, heading zero eight zero. Like so the, to go over it, you be at seven thousand. To go to go under it, you got to be at thirty five hundred. Uh, well, less than thirty five hundred. Whiskey, turn left. So before we get to this outer circle here, we got to be below three thousand five hundred, which makes sense anyway because the airport is not that far of a difference away. Pro that's probably uh, seven to eight miles. Uh, we'll start to send shortly. Now we're going to use, I think, uh, the zero 06 I think I had out there. Go to information. information. Run runway zero 06. So we're going to probably use zero 06. Number 758 Echo Sierra near. So zero 06 is behind us, basically, on this heading. So what we're going to do is probably make a left, uh, it's left traffic on 06, downwind, basically, and make a left crosswind. Sorry, left base. But yeah, so we got to be down 35, before 999. Get back on course here. In about 30 miles, we'll start our descent. Nice and easy. We're 20 minutes away. A little bit more smoother up here than it was down below. So I'll stay here as long as we can. Get, just get back on course here. Look how she's sleeping. Number seven, five, eight, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. She is just out. I don't know if I can get this camera to uh, do it. I don't know if you see it. Her, she's right here. I don't know that if you can see it. Down to 3,000.
Set at 408, one five miles from Cali, flooding zero. Okay, 40 zero. miles was our head downhill. So establish the final, cleared our Navy AQ, runway four red approach. Okay, uh, zero eight zero three until established, cleared for the RNAV Yankee four right approach, United four zero eight. Never mind, eight Echo Sierra to maintain three thousand. Going to maintain three thousand defender Echo Sierra. Approach uh, Mooney 8 7 November. Mooney 8 7 November, God. I uh, request, sir, to go downhill here to my destination. Number 8 7 November, descent your discretion. My discretion on the descent for 8 7 November, thank you. Okay, let's go down to uh, 55, a little bit at a time. Pull this power back. That is 408, contact Newark Tower 118.3. You did pretty so long, United 408. Okay, looking good. This power setting is okay. And we'll go downhill, 500 feet a minute-ish. If I had autopilot, I could go right here and set it. Oh, no, 500 feet a minute. Vertical speed, I should say, actually. But it will hopefully coming soon, the M20s. I'll go to. Great, it's good enough here. We're at 21.5 inches, and we're at 24.50 RPM. That's good enough there. And then we're gonna, as we go down, a little bit of mixture. I can see my exhaust temperatures climbing. But on new airplanes, everything is like electronic. You don't even gotta worry about that crap anymore. It's amazing. But airfoils don't change in new airplanes, just electronics and uh, all the engine updates and stuff like that. But it could continue to go down to 45 now. Let's bug that. Basically just following the highway in the sky here. <laughs> Any reference that they give you, use them, right? I mean... Why not? Number 758 Echo Sierra, contact approach 120.15. 2016, seven five eight Echo Sierra, take care. Power back a little bit more. We're 32, 34 miles out. Oh, we got a. We got plenty of time to get down. Plenty of time to get down. Not worried about it. Oh, uh, we'll go to 4,500 and stop. We're 33 nautical miles away. There's a lot of fields. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Um, but there's a, these, these are all working. Uh, there's a lot of fields out here, which is nice. So, to me, that means that, you know, it's, God forbid something happens, you're always looking for a place to land. You know, so, it's nice. As long as, the, the fields, as long as you land on the way the grooves are, you don't want to go against it. That would be a bad day. It could be a bad day either way, really, but, go with the grooves, you have a smoother landing, you, you might not roll it. We got plenty of time before we get to that airspace to be down to 35. 34999. Okay, we're approaching altitude. Approaching altitude. Thank you. <laughs> she just. I hope you guys can see that. I don't know how the camera is going to see that. 
but she's just chilling. She did that last time. I didn't videotape it. Sometimes I like to fly without having the cameras on. I'm sure you guys could agree with that. It's a lot of work. Um, but like I said before, basically all of, Janu all of January, I've been studying for the written, for the uh, instrument endorsement. And then, of course, uh, I've been doing flight hours with an instructor now and a safety pilot. So that, you know, I didn't put them on video. But I will put, I'm going to put, I talked to the, um, the, uh, the instructor. We're, we're going to do one video with you guys aboard. To see all my mistakes. <laughs> So I got some traffic in the area. I'm going to put my, because it's hazy out, and I got some traffic here, some traffic in front of me. I see one, two, three, four, five, six targets out there. It looks like they're all kind of making turns and practicing. I'm going to put my landing light on. Practicing. I'm going to put my landing light on, just so it's an extra uh, thing that they can see me on. Uh, my strobes are already on. It's an LED, LED light, so it's, it will last a long time. New York morning, it's a serious. Three, eight, eight, you guys can see this all over here. The fields are all practicing out there, looks like. Interaction with the HDX here, you can see these targets. That's all. That's them, target here, here, all the targets. So it's a lot out there today. It's a beautiful day. It's really beautiful. The outside temperature now is 50 degrees, and we're at 4,500. Oh, we're doing good. November Connect Philadelphia approach 124.35. 24.35 now for 8, 7 November. Good day, thank you. 791. Number 9869, the airport's 12 o'clock, 10 miles. Your radar service starts terminated. Stay on the beacon code. Contact Northeast Tower 126.9. Contact Northeast Tower 126.9. Philadelphia, good morning. Mooney, 8, 7 November is with you, 4,500. Jack Jeff 511, climb and maintain 10,000. Hey, 869 or Philly approach, or 87 November, Philly approach. Philly altimeter 3051, say destination. 3051, and we're going to Wings, uh, Lima, Oscar, Mike. All right, thank you. Just keep an eye out. You got the, you know, seven or eight airplanes between you and there. Maintain 4,500 as long as possible. We'll maintain 4,500 as long as possible, and I had them on the screen. We'll look for them. Thank you, sir. Never 4,992. Yeah. So you said the same thing, see? That's why I put the lane light on, too. There's a lot of targets out there. 4,992 cleared visual approach from right now to right. Maintain 180 knots or greater and uh, till a five-mile final. That's one good thing I have to say, folks. With the ADSB in and out stuff, I know a lot, I, I see both. I see both sides of everything, really. But it's really good to have them if you have the equipment to see these targets out there. Because on a hazy day, and you guys can see these cameras, you can't really see much. But to have to have them there to anticipate, to them anticipate you crossing your route or turning into your route, you can you know. Start to look for him. Okay, he's a thousand feet below. Okay, let's start looking for him. Let's start looking. Let's start looking. If you didn't have any of these, you still got to look outside, obviously. But when it's hazy, you know, without getting a heads up, you might be closer than you think and really get too close. Uh, you really can't see that far out. And, a lot of, and during the day, Depending on the color of your airplane, a lot of these planes blend in with the terrain. So it's it's good to have this stuff to give you a heads up. Two four four five. Thank you. Seven three tango alpha. Eight four heavy Philly approach. Maintain six thousand Philly altimeter three zero five one. Yeah, they're all fifteen below. Nine hundred below. We're we already passed this guy. They're all doing turns. Eighteen five. Brickyard forty seven eighteen. Brickyard forty seven ninety one. You're following a company one seventy five. One o'clock. Five miles eastbound. Thirty eight hundred feet descending on the final. Head sight. Brickyard forty seven ninety one. Approach runway nine and right, and maintain one seven zero knots to follow them. Follow them, clear visual approach nine right, one hundred seventy knots, forty seven ninety one. American four forty five, climb maintain one three thousand. One three thousand, American four forty five. American nine seventy nine, Philly approach should be runway nine and right. Do you have information, Juliet? Yeah, we have Juliet nine right, American. 
Uh, nine seven nine. Philadelphia, Hoist State 4, level 6,000. Hoist State 4, Philly approach, full heading uh, 230, vector for your climb, climb maintain 7,000. Heading 230, climb maintain 7,000, Hoist State 4. Let's go to information, let's go to comms. Are you going to come here? Yeah. Typical 12300, zero, zero, so we'll probably get a bunch of airports yeah, talking today because it's busy. We'll tune that to comm here, send a standby. Zero, zero. Got the weather. Philly departure, weather change, it looks like. We'll be looking south of 743. And southwest 743, you can turn left heading at 01. Philadelphia, main field, automatic weather observation. 1, 6, 0, 7, Zulu, weather, wind, 1, 3, 0, at 5. 4, heavy, climb into 1, 0. That's 1, 3. Which is 0, 1, 0, 1,000. Uh, Philly approach, dark copter, 7, 2, 6, still. Go ahead and do a crosswind component. Well, let's see what they're using. They might change it up. I don't know. Let's listen. Approach Picard 4 check TFRs, no pop up TFRs. We're good there. Let's see if we can listen to what they're using. From Medina across Medina at our I have a Unicom set. Let's see what they're doing. Zulu runway 9 right approach. 124.6, Got one guy coming out to my northwest ish. Depending on the winds, you know, I don't know what he's doing. We'll keep an eye out for him. And we got to get down to 34999 soon. A few miles here. So we're going to head down to 3,500. So we'll go just underneath that. Uh, zero, zero heading out of 1,400 for 5,000. Out of 1394, Philly departure, radar contact, traffic 11 o'clock and 3 miles, circling at 5,500, the sky lane. Okay, we're looking. Three two Lima Golf, I gave you a clearance to Belmar at three thousand five hundred. Okay, thank you, three two Lima Golf. Mountain eighty three thirteen, contact New York approach one two eight point five five. Twenty eight fifty five eighty three thirteen. Yep. Okay, we're looking good. Um we're approaching three thousand five hundred. We have a few more miles here before we gotta get down below um three thousand four nine nine or yeah, three thousand four nine 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 nine. <laughs> so we got a little time there. We'll keep going downhill a little bit. And we'll be there in 10 miles. We can continue. Traffic pattern altitude over here is 14. So we'll put 14. I'll go down there anyway. Let's get it. Interfilling approach. Mooney 8 November can cancel with the airport site. November 8, 7 November, thank you. Traffic 12 o'clock and 5 miles eastbound, 3,500 to light sport. There's also traffic, uh, you know, disregard. You can ask Corp VFR, contact uh, Corp VFR, change advisors approved. See ya. Okay, see you later. Thank you all the help. Appreciate it. Let's keep a sharp eye out. He said we got some traffic. I see him on the screen. I don't see him yet. Wings traffic. Mooney 688, 7 November is about uh, 6 miles out to the north. We'll be inbound for 6. Wings. Alright, we can get the gear. Gas. The carriage. They get bumpy down here a little bit. York traffic, Skyhawk 53010 is crossing uh, Exapa. Uh, doing a practice uh, arc. Gears locked. Uh, for runway 35 York. With 
Mooney's on a three mile 45 midfield left downwind for six wings. Bombeth Executive, traffic, Skyhawk, 48 Echo, 2500 feet. Gas, undercarriage, mixture, prop speed. speed. For a teardrop entry to 1 4 left powder. Bombeth count. Okay, 1,400 feet is traffic pattern altitude. Just about there. I don't see anybody. Oh, there's Philly out to our left. Really can't see it because of the haze. Traffic in Seneca is eight miles to the uh, Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. Now I see some smokestacks going on here. Um, it's going straight up. So winds could be calm on the ground. So we'll see how it shakes out. We'll look at the wind stock. And wings traffic, Mooney is left downwind uh, for six wings. A couple cameras died already. Okay. 14, traffic pattern altitude, we're good. Let's see if I can see to find the windsock down here. Lost a couple cameras. Oh uh, yeah, so it's a slight crosswind uh, for six. We'll go. We'll continue with six. It's almost a direct crosswind. Get a runway, I guess. It's favoring six, just a smidgen. Okay, let's keep this heading for now. One. Okay, we have flaps full. Gas is on, undercarriage, mixture of prop speed. Olive is sleeping. Uh, out. We're looking for 80 and short final 70 knots. To the north, to the down, runway 17, traffic, Skyhawk, 48 Echo, entering midfield, left downwind, runway 14 at 45. And wings traffic, Mooney turning base uh, to, uh, to six uh, wings. Mooney turning final six, full stop. Wings. Seneca, We're a little high. Flaps in full. Seneca, were you at, uh, at about 1100? Mm -hmm. my base. we cut each other off? Oh, I'm just a beam. You know, I see you. You're up. We're up. You're right. We'll follow you in. 500. Gear check good. Wings traffic, Cessna 717 Golf at the upper ramp, taxiing to 6 via Bravo. Wings traffic. Off. All right, that was not bad flight. Good flight. Pretty routine. Some heat, um, air in here for Olive. Got a lot of birds. And 
Seven wings, traffic, many clear six swings. Okay, clean it up a little bit. Flaps up, mixture's coming out, and fuel pumps off. And let's taxi on. Try to turn my O2 thing off. I had to forget to turn it off. And I'm gonna kill the battery. It's off. Awesome, awesome investment. It was not even expensive. And, uh, you know, everybody gets those. I don't know if the cameras are all dead or not, but everybody gets those little thing for like five bucks with that little, like almost like paint in the middle. Ah, spend a little extra cash. You have a nice system, the digital. It's for airplanes. Uh, it's really cool. I'll put it in the description below where you guys can find it on Amazon. I lost one this camera and the Skyview camera. And I got these couple of these yet going. We're gonna taxi over here, and that's. Well, thank you guys for flying along. We appreciate it, like always. Olive appreciates it. She's back there. Hope you guys can. I hope I want to edit. You guys can see her back there. And uh, it's like I'm doing, guys. Help me out. Subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate that, like always. Fly safe. Be safe. June twelfth, flying Orange County Airport. It was a great hit last year. And email me, pilotfunder101 at gmail.com with any questions. And if you're going to go to the fly-in, uh, email me with your tail number, rsvpflyin at gmail.com. I'd appreciate that, too. And you can find me on Facebook. Hey, guys, until next time, again, fly safe, be safe, and I'll see you. And I will see you.